Tonight, new research finds exercising may be more difficult for some people who have had COVID. Researchers taking a look at nine different studies and then found more than three months after contracting the virus, some participants had an exercise capacity similar to that of someone 10 years older. Our Dr. Frank George joins us now with a closer look at why this is happening. This is kind of discouraging, Doc. And that is definitely the question, Karen and Jason. You know, long COVID symptoms may experience, people with long COVID symptoms, I should say, may experience difficulty breathing, heart rate issues, and a reduced ability for their muscles to use oxygen. Even people with mild cases of COVID who were in top physical condition may find it difficult to bounce back. <laughs> Meredith Kaloyan is happy to be back on the field after complications from COVID almost sidelined her for good. I tried my best to push through it. Um, obviously, though, at times it was really bad and I couldn't play. The 19-year-old contracted the virus in January of 2021. She says her symptoms were pretty mild, but as soon as she started playing soccer again, she noticed some chest pain. Felt like a weird, sharp pain, and I like felt almost like I couldn't run. Concerned, her parents brought her to see Dr. Tamana Singh, a cardiologist at the Cleveland Clinic. So knowing she had acute COVID, you know, as a cardiologist, our first inclination is to rule out the quote-unquote scary stuff. Dr. Singh conducted a series of tests on Meredith and didn't find anything of major concern. Fortunately, her heart structure was normal and function was normal, and the MRI confirmed she had no inflammation of the heart muscle, so no myocarditis, and no inflammation of the pericardial sac or pericarditis. Meredith was given clearance to return to soccer, but it took more than a year to finally get back to where she is now. I would do um, like 15 minute intervals and then 20 and 30 and just keep going up, and then eventually I was back to being able to play full time. She says it was hard not to be impatient. Hardest thing for me to do. But her perseverance has paid off. Now, if you're having trouble exercising after COVID, it's really important to bring it to your doctor's attention to see if additional testing is needed to check for serious heart and lung issues. So what is the theory there? Why do some people have more difficulty and some have COVID and they're fine? Well, you know, actually, there's a lot of theories and there's not a lot of answers. One theory is that in some people, the virus impacts how effectively your body can use oxygen. The virus can also negatively impact the nervous system, which could also cause issues. The bottom line here, though, is we still really don't know why the virus has such a lasting impact in general on some people relative to others, but that is obviously a question that researchers are trying desperately to answer. It is crazy how it affects someone so drastically and others hardly at all. Right. Mystery of the universe right now.